Hello, hello. Welcome to my channel. My name is Brandy and this is Beautifly. Fly like a butterfly, but Beautifly bargains. And I am a full-time reseller on the eBay and the Poshmark. I'm also a full-time buyer. <laughs> from the Ebays and the Poshmarks and the Facebooks. So I am going to show you some of the items that I have purchased over the last couple of days. I'm not wearing any rings. So I feel naked. I'm like shy and I like don't know what to say. <laughs> oh God. Anyways, I picked up some pretty little things, you guys. I have some really good items to share. Um, all are from Facebook. This is from a auction page, which I will leave in the description. This one is a little different from the other auction page that I talk about. These ones are um, more, they're silent. So you, should, you just bid on a picture, on a photo. And I did very well with this one. I believe I got it for $18 US. And from my understanding, I could probably list this for $75 Canadian. Oh, yes, I did. I did. So I don't know yet. I This is another Sarah Coventry item, which I thought was going to be a better match. Uh, but it turns out that is not... So, I don't know. I'm thinking about reselling it. Mama needs some money in the bank. Christmas is here. So, I'm definitely uh, going to get a few snaps and see. Let's just see if the world gravitates. Anyways, this was absolutely gorgeous. This is, like I said, a Sarah Coventry. And it is signed Sarah Coventry. There are a few more listed like it. I didn't actually check the comps comps because um, I wanted to hold on to it for a day or two. <laughs> Pretty. And then these other items I got are from, um, sorry, let me fix my angle here, y'all. I don't want my phone to bugger up right in the middle. Of what I'm doing. I'm going to pause you. Alright guys. I'm trying over here. I'm trying. Okay. I'm trying. <laughs> uh, so this is a mixture. This is. All from Facebook. But the one item. So these items. The Juicy Couture earrings. I got these separately. So I'm just going to dump it out. Do some first impressions. I paid um, $10 for the earrings. Okay, so let's move my beautiful vintage gorgeous. We'll take her out for a minute. Don't want to get scratched. <laughs> and um, these other lots I purchased, I got for $20. Now these are going to blow you away. They're pretty nice. These are pretty nice. Little first impressions. Uh-oh, we're upside down. Okay, I fixed this. <laughs> I'm just going to kind of put her over to the side. And uh, we'll just look up, look at it up close. I haven't really looked at it yet either myself. So, we shall do it together. Oh, here's the other earring. Oh, this is pretty. That looks like hematite, you guys. And possibly sterling. So I'm going back to see this lady that I purchased these pretty items from. And then this other lady, um, she had these. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep them in the box or not. I might try and find a new box for them. But I got them for 10 and they're listed for 50 and sold for 50 So I'm happy with that. I'm going to try and get those listed today. Not really sure about the box. We shall see. We shall see. 
Now, this little beauty. Here, I want to kind of keep the... Whoa. <laughs> tumbling. I'm tumbling. This looks like hematite to me. And this also looks like a tax co piece, but it's not signed. And it's very much vintage. I just don't know if it's silver. I don't see any mucks. Do you? This is a very nice, very, very, very nice chain. Made to be a choker. Let's just see. Six and six is 12. Yeah, it's not very big, you guys. It's a choker for sure. Just lovely. Very nice piece, actually. I'm going to try and give her a little bath. Oh, something happening over here. What is that? No, this actually looks vintage. <laughs> All right. My phone is falling, you guys. My phone is falling. I don't know how to make it tighter. Oh, no. That's not the way. <laughs> okay, stop. We're good. We're good. We're good. Oh, the technical technical difficulties all the time. Here she is, y'all. She is probably the best thing since sliced bread. The ultimate pendant, which I wish I found before. Um, she is uh, nine two five Italy. She's got her little gold stamp there. But yeah, she's, I love it. I can't even get enough. Like I paid $20 for this lot. So I got a really good deal. I'm really happy. Really happy. You know, you, you win some, you lose some, you get some bad lots, you get some good lots, you know, and this is definitely another good lot for me. Now, I don't know if I'll be reselling her quite as right away. <laughs> And then this is a Betsy Johnson um, pendant. It is not signed anywhere, but I know it is Betsy Johnson. Because the whole lot is Betsy Johnson, I'm pretty sure. Either way, I got the tag. <laughs> uh, beautiful enamel. Little faux pearl going on there. Nice bright orange. Trunks up, trunks up. And then we have another elephant, a topaz elephant. Um, possibly a keeper for me for a little while. I like the elephants too. But look at the, the quality. She's got to get a chain for her. Trunks up. <laughs> And then we got this little girly, which I'm very happy about. Now, apparently this is also Betsy Johnson. It isn't signed anywhere. Like, there's nothing proving to me that this is Betsy Johnson. Like, at all. But how flippin' chicken noodle cooped. Cute. Oh, hang on. Maybe she signed, y'all. Maybe she signed this one. No. The chain is copper, vintage, something or another. And it does not have a clasp. I'll be reselling this little one. So it's actually green and red. I don't know why it's showing up blue and orange. Because the colors are actually green and red. That's so weird. I got to change the color of my light. Hang on. Let me see if that's what's happening, y'all. See there? She's green and red. <laughs> now she's blue and orange. 
Oh my god, y'all. That's kind of weird. Okay. Anyways, this one will be listed right away. Probably $22 I'll list it for, maybe. And I have another beautiful Betsy Johnson necklace. In excellent condition. Rose gold and a little mushroom. I haven't checked the comps on any of these yet, but no stones missing. And the chain has no clasp again. Which I find strange, but we're going with it. Let's see what's on the end of this little guy. It's a penguin! <laughs> Oh, I love this little guy so much. He's got a bright red scarf, a big old chubby belly. He's got moving arms. We have a signed Betsy Johnson hearts. I don't know, depending on the comps, this one's going to be probably 35. We'll see. I don't know what the comps are yet. We'll see, we'll still see. I love it. Again, 20 bucks, y'all. I got it all for 20 bucks. So what a really awesome opportunity for me to make some money to support me and my children who likes to eat a lot. See, duty calls. Anyways, my children are bottomless pits and they just eat and 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 eat <sighs> yeah I just get fat looking at them eat <laughs> I'm not a very good cook you guys like I'll own it I'm not I'm not very nifty in the kitchen when it comes to like cooking and I gotta do the dishes <laughs> you know and get you a glass of water and stuff but yeah, I'm not a very good cook. I yeah, this guy was. Look at those red eyes. But I do give it a honest try. Like, I try to do, you know, supper every day. This is not marked um, Betsy Johnson. So I'm not sure if it is or not. But, cool piece. A little bit late would have been better for Halloween, but it is what it is. I will still post it. All right. Now this is a beaut. Where do I have a form? This is actually a pin. And I think what I'm going to do is possibly put the elephants on this chain. And take her, take the pin off. Because I don't like the way, well I do like it, but I feel like this should be a pin and not a pendant. And I feel this is a pendant. Or I could even put the other elephant on there. This looks a bit, um, not tarnished, but worn. Maybe it's meant to look that way because it's all pretty evened out. <laughs> but, um... Anyways, this is a beautiful, beautiful brooch. And it's beautiful colors, not missing any stones. And it's definitely a quality piece that I'm going to try and resell right away. I was very happy with this lot, you guys. I was like literally giddy when I got it. And she's got more. She's got the Hello Kitty one. So I'm going to go back and see see her probably on the weekend I gotta stop buying and start selling <laughs> I'm planning to do some sort of sale here right away something good something juicy guys something juicy you're gonna love it we'll see we'll see I did very well with my first little Facebook sale 
I did sell most of the items. Um, so yeah, some went to the United States. Oh, there's a little kink in that chain there, La. And the rest went to Ontario. That's that's what's going on. Look, a kink in the chain. Now I tried comping this beauty, and she could not be found. Only similar ones, but nothing with this beautiful cat eye belly, like aurora borealis cheeks. Come on, you guys, like. This is a showstopper. And then Betsy Johnson, Betsy Johnson. Hello, Mr. Parrot. Not sure what it's worth. It's a big guy. It's a big one. It measures a lot. Four inches almost. Oh no, sorry, three. What am I saying? <laughs> Look. Anyways, she's cool. She's fabulous. Now I have this other ginormous, beautiful um, seed bead shell necklace that I very much like, very much like. And it's in new condition. And it's very hard to button things up with your fingernails, guys. I'm gonna, I was thinking about doing a video about, uh, with my rings, so I don't have a lot of my rings listed just because I don't know the size or just a lot of work and I just only got my ring sizer recently, so I haven't been able to really do much with it. So I'm thinking about coming on here and doing a video and doing a whole size and number and price tag kind of thing on it. And, yeah, I was thinking about just kind of showing off what I got. I don't have too many. I do have a nice little collection going, but not as good as others. But I definitely got some in there that needs to be sold. So, I'm thinking about doing that. This is very nice. I would definitely probably feel like this could be a $10 necklace or do them as a lot because I have many more. Here's another abalone shell with the seed beads like look at the detail on this one. Oh, you can't because i zoomed you out but this one is just so pretty look at the back i like it that way you know beautiful condition nice seed beads this one's really nice wrong time of year but i think we'll be okay <laughs> i'd probably do two of them for 15. Two for 15. You guys could have them for five bucks. Two for 10. And then I'll list them for two for 15, probably. They're nice. I love them. They're very nice. What, like, really nice work done into them, especially with these, like, the wooden beads. These are, like, new condition. Yay, I'm happy. I'm happy with this lot. Yay. All right, favorite time. I like this. Uh, I'm gonna get these listed here. Pronto, pronto. I love this witch. I absolutely, absolutely love my witch. She is amazing, and I really like this hematite choker, which I think is vintage somehow and has been maybe added the chain after but this is really nice i wonder if i should try cleaning it uh, we'll see and i love the brooch the brooch was fabulous and of course can't forget toucan sam this was a great little lot i paid 30 dollars for this all and i definitely um have an opportunity to make some money I think these will sell quickly. We'll see. Oh, oh my God, I almost forgot the showstopper, the main attraction. This is, I loved anything Sarah, Sarah Coventry. So I collect a lot of Sarah Coventry. I also sell 
sell Sarah Coventry. So I'm kind of like on the fence with her. I do love anything and everything that she's made in my birdstone. And um, I have a lot more just dainty little Sarah Cub items. Got in a couple more rings, some bracelets. I got a, quite a little collection going now of hers. And then I also collect uh, butterflies and, you know, Halloween funky stuff, witchy craft stuff. <laughs> you know, I'd, I'd love to join a coven. I love this witchy stuff. I'm learning more about crystals. Look at this. I got, these are all some sort of crystal in there. But, uh, anyways, guys, uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Leave me a comment. Leave me a comment, because I'm going to be picking a video with comments and do a random comment picker at any time, like possibly in this video, if you put hashtag, I don't know. <laughs> Hashtag, I don't know. <laughs> hashtag Topaz Jewelry. Or hashtag Sarah Coventry. Or hashtag Beautiful Light Bargains. Hashtag winning. I feel like hashtag winning is the one. Is the definitely the one. Because we're definitely winning with this these little lots that I picked up. Thank you all so much for sticking around. Welcome to anybody who's new. If you like this video, give me a little thumbs up. You know, put the thumb up. And, uh, subscribe. Yeah, yeah. Give me a little subscription, you know. Turn that notification on and, you know, that's what you're supposed to do. So, take care, everyone. Bye.